<coughs> Hi everybody. Hey, Sir drinks a lot. You're on the road with the wolf. It is March 31st, 2018. Easter weekend. He is risen. For you Christians, I guess. Uh, <laughs> laugh it up. Yes. Wine hearts. I believe they also do alcoholic beverages. So, uh, um, but I found these guys. It's a gourmet trout style head. It's a gourmet soda, handcrafted with natural artificial flavors, including sassafras, which is in the area. My mom makes sassafras tea. It's, it's pretty good, actually. Uh, vanilla and honey, which honey is also. I've been thinking about making root beer. I have. Um, I made mead a while back, um, which was really, really awesome. It was not as good as I wanted. I should have used more honey. It was a bit more dry and, and not as sweet as I would have wanted. But uh, that being said, uh, root beers could be interesting. I could be, I could be down with that. Really good. Um, anyway, <clears throat> Winehearts, I was in Longview, uh, late one night, coming back from a drive with some friends of mine, in one of those gas stations, diesel, you know, where the big trucks would come in too, you know, uh, like a Loves or something, and I saw this, and I was like, oh, it's a glass bottled root beer, and of course, glass bottled Cokes, and stuff like that, you know, uh, this is kind of cool. Yeah, let's give this a shot. And I remember, it, like, I just, I was just like really, really taken, taken aback by it. And it's been a while since I had one. So I thought, why the heck not? Let's revisit Winehearts and then see what we think. The little cap has a guy on it that says, Can't top this. Is there anything on the inside? No, okay. Ah, oh, yes. It's like Barks and AW, they have, like, Barks has bite. Well, a lot of root beers have that tart, ah, you know, but it's good. I mean, I'm not, I'm not saying it's like, but Whitehorse doesn't have that. Besides the carbonation, it's a very smooth root beer. It's very sweet. A lot of root beers can be really sweet, but the Weinhardt's is pretty darn sweet. Traditional facts, one bottle per serving, ha <laughs> um, 180 calories, that's not bad, really. Um, sodium is 40 milligrams, lower than some of the things I've been drinking. 43 grams, uh, total carbs, 42 grams of sugar, protein, zero, no chunkiness. Uh, total fat, zero, yeah, so uh, not bad. good smooth root beer it's good it's simple uh, I would actually like this I'd like to make a root beer float with this I think that would be amazing uh, ooh, I like it very sweet very nice but not too sweet you know but then again some people might be like this is too sweet <laughs> anything sweeter than this would also be too sweet <laughs> So, yeah, it takes their own. I, I I like it. Like some people do like that 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 tartness, that that bite when you drink a root beer, you know. Uh, and I do too. But it's kind of nice to have something a little bit different, to where you don't have to worry about that as much. Uh, yeah, that's good stuff. They 
got it. Man, I'm, I'm almost done with it. But, uh, okay, rating system here. Uh, yeah, um, I'm going to give it a 4 and 8. Give it a 4 and give it an 8. A little low in the 10. Uh, but uh, besides that, yeah, this is a solid root beer. Um, definitely, definitely high up. Higher than I put, you know, just some others. Oh, and a burp out of it, too. You can't go wrong with that. Yeah. If you get a root beer that gives you the burp, hey. Maybe I need to, like, dig. Have, like, a something for every time I burp this. Oh, I feel so silly. <coughs> anyway, i doing some construction. That's nice. I didn't get a chance to wave back. I hate it when you're, like, you know, wave at you and you want to wave back but you're like I don't have an extra hand buddy also same thing with plastics or bottles like this drink responsibly folks don't throw your stuff out the window you know just don't do it even if it means having to pick up your stuff later you have a floorboard or get a get a cardboard box put it in the seat you know or trash bag, hang it somewhere, you know. Um, if your significant other doesn't want to deal with your trash, find something to do with it, you know. Uh, just be careful with driving, you know, since I, I obviously advocate drinking and driving. Non alcoholic beverages. Still, I wonder if that's a bad thing. I mean, there's drinking and driving, and then there's drinking. Anyway, <laughs> this is a drink slot. Wishing you health, wealth, and love, and enough time and gusto to enjoy all of it. That is good stuff. <laughs>